In 2005, Fox Interactive hired me and my studio to create the cinematics for their upcoming game, Predator Concrete Jungle. A lot of you have asked to see some of my past animation work, so here we go. Keep in mind, this wasn't ILM or Pixar. This was done by me and I think four other artists. We all just shot and keyframe animated the entire thing. It's always fun to look back on your older work, so thank you all for pushing me to show some of it. Oh, and look for an Easter egg in on a billboard in one of the opening shots. One of the artists snuck it in for fun. And so it began, this tragedy of two worlds, this epic fall and rise of men and monsters, this story of power, revenge, and unnatural love. The devil had broken the laws of its own kind. It had made its presence known to its prey in a devastating and humiliating way. And worse, it had survived the exposure. We now know that these creatures are nomadic, bound by strict clan loyalties, unbreakable taboos. Disgrace and exile were all this one could expect. simply ends. The events of that sweltering night in June sent ripples through time. Because in its long absence, we humans had dissected the hunting tools our devil dropped in its haste. And using what we learned, we made ourselves masters of a technology unknown on Earth. We created weapons of our own that we turned against the devils when next they came hunting in the hot season. So they sent it back to atone for the sins of its past and take from us what we had stolen. Back to a city grown from the shattered ruins it had left behind. A city of tomorrow overseen by computer intelligence, driven by advanced alien technology and ruled by a dynasty of crime. What once was Nui City had blossomed into Neonopolis, City of Light.